It was a very close call on video for a police officer who's been patrolling the colony for two years. Fox 4's James Rose talked with the officer and his wife who share the experience of a dangerous encounter and a dreaded phone call in the middle of the night. There's no such thing as a routine traffic stop, but there's no such thing as a, anything routine with police work. The Colony Patrol Officer Carlos Henderson knows this firsthand. This is dash camera video from his patrol car early Tuesday morning. Henderson got a report of a driver passed out on the 121 service road in Spring Creek Parkway at the Colony Frisco border. As he does a welfare check, cars are passing on either side of him. And when I opened the door, he didn't wake up either. He just kind of leaned forward, he leaned out further out the door. What were you thinking then? At that point, I'm like, I got to get this car in park before he wakes up and takes his foot off the brake. Seconds later, police say 26-year-old Brian Osborne just took off, dragging Henderson down the road. My hand was, my arm was just stuck in that seatbelt and nothing me hit the ground and just it pulled off the, it pulled my shoulder out. Paramedics were on the scene within minutes and rushed Henderson to the hospital. His wife Kimberly works early mornings and helps raise her six children. She was asleep when it happened and woke up to 15 missed calls. If he was at the hospital and not lying on the side of the road somewhere, I knew I had somewhat of a chance to at least see my husband again. Um, you know, and I, and I truly thought while I was driving there that I was going to say goodbye to him. She feared the worst, but words like these gave her comfort. The text reads, Carlos has a job that requires him to fight crime and suppress evil. Your job of being a cop's wife is much harder. Hang in there. We have your back. I have a stack of get well cards at my, at my job that, I mean, from people I don't even know. Henderson says it was tough showing his children what happened, but he still wants to know one thing. I think my main question is why did he feel like he had to do this? You know, it, 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 I think that's the part that's the most, uh, most confusing. While that is confusing, one thing is crystal clear. I've never had a job before that I enjoyed or loved doing more than I do this job. I, I, can, I can't imagine seeing our life in any, other, in any other way because he's doing exactly what he was called to do. In the Colony, James Rose, Fox 4 News.